we'll be joking. We'll be doing the same thing right now. And Susie, he loved you. Loved you. Yeah. Like a sister. And talked about you all the time, even when you weren't around. Darn Trent. <laughs> I was doing so good until you said that. You know? Because that really helped me, you know, about we gained an angel. Suze, we good. Trust we me. We're, we're lucky. We're very, very lucky. Yeah. And we're grateful. And yeah. we're grateful for the spirit of Sue. I mean, it was just, it was, yeah. it was, un, it, it was undaunted, indomitable. And uh, we're grateful. We're grateful for you. Yeah. On January 10th, he was laid to rest. And it was a magnificent service celebrating his spirit. It was powerful, emotional, joyful. As stories were shared and tears shed, we realized how vast his impact truly really was. You know, like, just like the guys said, you could feel everyone wanting to pay it forward to be a better parent, friend, cancer fighter, or truly Stuart just to simply have more fun because he loved to have fun. And Stuart loved his golf. This is his 40th birthday outing, flanked by his dad on his left, and on the right his buddies, Scotty, Paul, and Brian. And perhaps our most treasured connection, Stuart and I, I was honored to hold his daughter Taylor the day she was born. And he held my daughter Kellen on, on the day of her, her birth. I'm sorry. Doing great, Sus. So let me share my favorite picture. Because when Kellen was nine months old, she came to her very first NFL game. Mm. And I just always thought that picture was magical. Oh, so what will I miss the most? He was universally known for his hugs. Strong, meaningful, and filled with love. We can't replace that. Nope. But we were happy we had him in our lives. And the legacy lives on, which of course is what Stuart was all about too. In his memory, the V Foundation created the Stuart Scott Memorial Cancer Research Fund to help assist some of the most vulnerable and disproportionately impacted communities. Stuart was a passionate voice for improving care for African Americans and other minorities with cancer. If you want to contribute, visit jimmyv.org backslash Stuart Scott.